adding a head to a ready-made puppet. In this tutorial we will show you how to use the ready-made puppets that have the tap to add photo drop zones on them. Drag and drop the sky background up in the air from the right bar and the green superman body from the left one. Press animate. Tap on the red sign attached to the place where the head normally should be. Let's choose a photo of Steve Jobs from the gallery. Press cut out and then cut tool. I'm left handed so I'm switching the cut tool to point to the right. Press cut and then move the cut tool around Steve's head. Let's scale it so it fits a little better. Now we'll move the head behind the body. Bring up the timeline. Press Contents. The upper bar serves as the front to back tool. Move Steve's head behind the body that is to the right. Now we can move the Superman Steve on the screen. The frame switcher appears on the left. You can swipe your finger up and down to switch the frames on the Superman's body. Press record and move Steve to the right. To save the project we need to bring up the timeline again and then press the little diskette in the lower left corner. Enter a file name and press the diskette to save. Press the green door to exit the animation screen. To export the project to YouTube we need to press the export button in the lower left corner. Press YouTube. Please note that if you're not logged into YouTube, you will also get another pop-up asking for your logon details, but here we only enter the movie details. Press Publish. The movie is being compressed and uploaded to YouTube. Twitter was on too, so the link to the movie appears, appeared on your Twitter status. project during export is being compressed so it might take a while. Afterwards press the green OK button. Now we can switch to the photo gallery and check out the movie. 